We can okay. trade content. We we can trade it all day. If you want to shoot and you know we we trade, that's fine with me. Because mm-hmm. the way I edit is not the way you edit. Our our scenes may be exactly the one scene, but the editing, the detailing, those are two different scenes by the time you get done editing and yeah. by the time I get done editing, that shit don't look exactly the same. It may have the same actions, but you may put the pussy eating after the fucking. You may put the dick sucking right before the cum shot. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, There's yeah, yeah. To transition in these scenes. I have set times for each position. I do five positions and a pop. That's me. The reason why I do five positions and a pop is because I can cut that scene up five different ways. Oh, yeah. Shit. You're going to make the most money off of that. That's a good idea. But the worst part is, guess what? Hmm. People so busy worrying about, man, I just want to fuck. They set that phone up and they just go. Yeah. Nah. See. Yeah, but you you got to get those different angles. But that's that's a good way because you can just chop that video down. That's different video sales on all the different platforms. So what, what, what are your like top three to five platforms that you're on? That are your favorites? So, pornbreadinc.com. Duh, let's shout that out. <laughs> Alfonsolays.com. <laughs> uh, X videos and mini vids. Okay. And I do have, I have two OnlyFans. I have Pornbread OnlyFans and I have Alfonso Lays OnlyFans. For me, I'm a dude. I'm not the other guy you know what the the name that i will not speak i will not give any creditation to that i don't think any of that ghost fucking is popping i think ghost fucking is trash and for all of those people that enjoy playing around on camera that's fine what is ghost fucking like the guys that don't want to show their face them too all the ghost fucking is trash what is the different types of ghost fucking you know the guys that do the you know the guys that do the hip to hip action and shit. No dick being seen. You know they ghost fuck. They they ghosting like a motherfucker. Oh okay. But okay. I don't speak. I don't, I don't. I don't speak on those situations because it's not something that I want to do. And I want to keep mm-hmm. controversy out of my name and my company because my company over here, we're strong. It's real dick over here. <laughs> Well, then I think they should just, consider, instead of calling themselves porn stars, because they're not actually porn stars, they just fall more into the content creating realm of things. And I think- Well, a lot of these, a lot of those gentlemen don't call themselves porn stars because they know they're not. They know when them real lights come on and they got to actually be on a real set, cameras and all that shit. Mm-hmm. They know they're going to ghost the fuck out of that scene. That scene is going to be great. It'll be the hottest scene on earth. It'll look like some fucking going on, but there ain't no there ain't no stiff dick around there. That's all fucking gummy balls. You know what I'm yeah. saying? That's more fucking that's tender dick McNugget. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. But some of them have made a name for themselves and it and have kind of got a I, well, I mean, I, I mean I can respect it. I, I can respect comedy porn. I think comedy porn is needed. You know, it's comedy porn. It's it's funny. You know, it's cute. Yeah, but 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 you know, as a professional who's been in the industry as long as I have been, I mean, get your money, Playboy. But I'm offended. <coughs> I can be honest about that. Get your money, Playboy. But I'm offended. 